During the coronavirus pandemic, health officials have encouraged companies to allow as many employees as possible to work from home. But how effectively could you do your job from there? Let's look. If you are working from home and you're going to be doing other tasks, particularly uploading very, very large files to the cloud, then you may need to look into, are you on the right plan? That's more important now than ever, since many of us will be doing more than ever from our home networks. You may want to look at going to something that's 75 megabits per second or even higher to the 150 megabits per second speed range, even if it is just for a month or two. You may find yourself doing more video conference calls, but that requires a certain speed of internet, five to 10 megabits per second. If you don't have that at home, you may wanna consider upgrading, at least for the short term. But it's not just video conferencing. Will your kids be home watching Netflix and playing on their phones while you work? The more items you have connected to your network, the slower it will run. The biggest thing that you want to look at is what devices are online. So, for example, if your kids are using an older iPhone to just play games and you feel that your network is a little slower than normal, it's probably that you have plenty of speed, but that slower device may be slowing down all the devices on the network. On top of that, if you're not going to set up shop directly next to the router, you might want to consider an internet booster. Com Comcast offers one they call X5 Pods, but you can find them at any electronic store. If you're going to be working from home and you're creating an office in the basement so you can get away from the kids, and maybe your service isn't as strong in the basement, you might want to check out some kind of a network extender that helps you expand that signal to the hard to reach areas. So the bottom line, think about what you want to do and check the speed that you pay for. Make sure it's enough for what you want to do and what you need to do.